for the Cherries up towards the halfway line. If you're joining us late, Cherries from left to right in this first half. Three changes from the Southampton game. Stacey Pearson and Raquel Me replaced by Smith, Lerma and Stanislas. As the Cherries knock it on for Billing here. Will it sit for the shot? Yes, it will. And there is Phil Billing on target again for the fifth time this season. Advancing on from midfield. It's sat up beauty for him on his left foot. And he lashed it past Bettinelli with his left foot. And the Cherries inside 15 minutes have the first goal on the board. Forward comes Mark Boller, who landed a header on the roof of the bar, remember, in the closing minutes of the first half. Fired in towards Watmore. Lovely first touch from Watmore. Shot across goal. Sneaks into the corner. And Middlesbrough have the equaliser that's been coming as Duncan Watmore ends his barren run without a goal. Great first touch out of his feet. And then left-footed across Begovic. Midfield as Billing plays it in for Dan Drew, and that's a nice link up between those two. And Billing now looking up for opportunities in the middle, rolls it in towards the penalty spot. Will it run for Lerma? Yes, it will. Deflected into the net. Jefferson Lerma gets the credit. And Bournemouth have only found themselves pegged back for a matter of minutes as Jefferson Lerma's effort from the edge of the penalty area took a touch off a defender, completely from Spettinelli, and Bournemouth edge back in front. It's a great response, but I wonder, do you sit the stubs back down? I think we're coming here, but. Billing stretches a long leg in the centre circle to win it back. Now Stacey coming central. He's found a great ball out to Solanke on the right-hand side and now a reverse for Solanke, who's got Stacey in the middle. Solanke might not need him, lashes it for goal. Better than he beats it away. Solanke, this time, does stab it into the back of the net. And surely that's going to be enough. Jonathan Woodgate against his hometown club might be leading his adopted club into the top six of the championship this evening. Dom Solanke, just his second goal in his last 12 games. It's 12 of the season. And is that game over at 3-1? Well, he deserves that so much for all the hard work he's put in, Solanke. He smashed it hard, and to, to, to carry on...